Ever wondered if there's a cream which can give you Botox-like results without needles, doctor visits, or the scary side effects? Today, we're breaking down Argiraline, the skincare product that's making waves online and asking, can it fulfill these promises? I'm Dr. Cena, a board-certified UK consultant dermatologist, and on this channel, I'm all about no-nonsense skincare. I want to know where's the evidence, is it effective, and is it worth your hard-earned money? So let's get stuck in. Argiraline, often dubbed Botox in a bottle, is a tiny peptide, a fragment of protein that promises to relax facial muscles and reduce wrinkles. Argiraline works by targeting the muscles lying beneath your skin on the face and essentially reducing their contractions. It does this by mimicking a protein called SNAP25 and interfering with the formation of a complex of proteins called the snare complex. This system helps transmit nerve signals to muscles. Think of it like gently blocking the message which tells the muscle to contract. So on the surface, pardon the pun, it sounds very much like a form of topical Botox, doesn't it? But how does Botox work in comparison? Well, Botox essentially cuts the SNAP25 within the snare complex, blocking the signal telling the muscle to contract. So a subtly different mechanism. One of the key points is that Botox is directly injected into the target muscle, helping it to reach its target effectively. With Argiraline, however, we rely on the product diffusing through the skin barrier all the way down to the muscle muscle layer. Now, where's the evidence? Well, studies as early as 2002 have shown results in humans, showing that Argiraline was successfully able to permeate through the skin and in 10 healthy female volunteers, showing a reduced wrinkle depth up to 30% in 30 days of treatment. So yes, granted very low sample size, but it is something. Subsequent studies have supported this in larger cohorts of patients with this one in particular showing a statistically significant effect in a cohort of 60 patients. So how do you use Argiraline serum? Firstly, look for products with specifically a 5-10% to concentration of Argiraline. Apply to clean, dry skin usually twice a day. Make sure you massage gently, don't rub aggressively, and combine with moisturizers or ultra-low molecular weights hyaluronic acid for better absorption. So can Argiraline actually replace Botox? Well, not really. Botox has a much stronger evidence base of randomized control trials in human subjects. Furthermore, it doesn't just interfere with the snare complex, it cleaves it, so it cuts it at a very specific point. On top of that, it's injected directly to where it's needed, so much more targeted effect. And this explains how it can last for much longer than Argiraline generally. So is Argiraline worth your hard-earned money? Well, if you're having Botox already regularly, there's not really much point. What I would say is for people who want to avoid going for regular aesthetic treatments or are needle phobic, this is a good alternative for a topical skincare routine. But is it a magical wrinkle eraser? Well, no, don't believe those claims. The good thing is that the cost of Argiraline is actually very cost effective, less than £10 from the ordinary. If you found this video useful, please like and subscribe. It helps me out a lot and it'll help me produce this kind of content for you in the future. Dr. Cena, signing off for now.